Ha ha, you are down there. I'm up here. What you gonna do? What are you going to do? Ha ha. Oh snap. Well, since y'all jumped up here, let's come. Come on. Go. Oh yeah, baby, it's happening again. Now, I did a boo-boo, and I'm gonna show y'all what I did on this unit. All the other units say on the VFDs, I'm gonna show you something. This one says 62, this one says 60. So all the other ones are like that. This one's not. It wasn't. And it was freezing up. So to get it to stop freezing up, as you can see, it's not freezing up. I raised this one to match all the other Aeon units to 60. But then I was looking at a video I made yesterday I had to come up here, they said it wasn't working, but now I think I know what. I did a boo-boo. Look at that. Four. 43 hertz, it's supposed to be at 43. And when I came up here and it was freezing up, it was at like at 20. So, that's not it, that's not it. See, it's at 11 amps, so that's not good. amps so it went from 11 amps which it says do not exceed like 10.6 to 649 ish amps so I made a boo-boo and I overdrew it I overdrove this thing these wires are kind of warm actually but that could be you know because it's warm in here but I put it back to where it was so there we go. So we're pulling 137 volts at six, 6.9 amps or seven amps. So that's the way it's supposed to be. That's, that's mainly what you want to do is like when you, if you cut off the unit to reset the VFD. And I want to, I also want to see if the power is lost to the system, if it's going to hold my 43 hertz it should because that computer in there doesn't control this this is totally independent as far as i know it can't it doesn't change it so that's the reheat valve making that racket oh, let's see if this fixes our problem downstairs it, it's just really humid. It's almost like this thing's not doing its dehumidification and stuff. So, but I made a boo-boo, guys. I made a boo-boo. I shouldn't be adjusting this uh, VFD. But I don't know what, what it's supposed to be on. Thank God this tag's here and not, like, fell off or sun faded. 
but um, uh, so we went from 11 amps, which wasn't. It said do not exceed four loading amps more than 115 percent. That's definitely not the not the case there. So fans pulling back up. So if y'all don't know, relay most of the time on these relay one is the VFD turns that on, turns the fan on. Relay two is circuit one, and relay three is circuit two. So then four would, four could be, uh, if you had three circuits, it could be something else. It, it could be anything. You can, if a relay goes bad, you could actually take another, another wire and swap it for the two, but you better make sure somebody knows that that's coming behind you, you know? better just to leave it alone but to get somebody by on cooling you can do that all right so here comes stage one powered up the unloader the unloader is getting a signal and it's gonna say oh let's turn the compressor on now so here comes the compressor I got an understanding of how these things work little bit it makes things a little bit easier to look at so all right, so. right off the bat what I can tell is with the fan speed lowered it does it does sound the compressor does sound different shoot their oil out of the compressor into the into the system i guess i mean it's not just aeons i mean there's a lot of other brands out there but, but okay well we're gonna give this a shot this compressor will come on eventually here in a bit when this thing starts getting satisfied and we'll see because i think i was moving too much air by upping the speed on that motor I can up it a little bit, but let's see if it freezes up or anything. And let's see if we can get anything to sweat back, but I doubt it. Um, because these these tubes are these tubes usually are sweating and dripping and stuff. So there's something wrong with this unit still. I don't I just almost broke it more than I had to, so um, just be weary of that if you're messing around. If y'all if you're ever on a a on in it and messing around with those BFDs. Of course, if you're training this stuff, you you'll be like, duh, Jeff, duh. But it's a little morning time before it starts raining. I knew I screwed up when I watched the video yesterday that I posted, and I was like, ooh. So, maybe it'll work now. I don't know. We'll give it a shot when it gets hotter today. Guys, it's Jeff the Maintenance Man once again. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And y'all have a great day. And it was at this moment he knew that he fucked up. Poor little guy. Probably gonna die now. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>